guys, it's your girl Karo NG here again and welcome back to this beautiful channel where we grow and glow. It's Sunday morning and I thank God for this beautiful morning. So, uh, Sunday is usually a resting day for me, but today I've just decided to make it different. I'll be trying to learn something new in the afternoon and that's why I decided to tag you along. I hope you are going to enjoy the every bit of this video. In case you are new to this channel, make sure you subscribe and feel very, very welcome. We love visitors. So let's get into the video. I just woke up with a dirty sink and as usual I don't prepare breakfast without cleaning up. So I'll clean up these utensils then I will prepare my breakfast so that we can head up for church. For breakfast, I'll just go ahead and make some tea, then we will have it with some loaf. I'm not going to do anything complicated because I don't want to, us to get uh, late for church. This is the outfit of the day for my daughter and mine is here it's a okay japiki kapasi vizuri it's a what a multi ikona kitenge na material i don't know how i should call it it's a long dress and, and i'll be wearing it with these beautiful shoes so guys we are all dressed and ready to go to church Hello, ni meva kama bibi ya pasta. So here, here is baby. Salimia watu ma. Wambi unenda wapi? So let's run to church. Then we will come and uh, go on with the afternoon activities. out 
from church and I just realized it's past 12 and I've not yet cooked. So I'm going to keep my daughter busy with this melon as I try to uh, fix the lunch. We, I'm going to be cooking rice uh, because that one is going to take uh, just a little time. So in the meantime, let me just keep her busy with this as she waits for her lunch. Bye-bye. So my rice is ready and I've also prepared some lentil stew and potatoes. So my daughter will be uh, eating the rice and lentils and I'll be eating this githeri that uh, was left yesterday night because I don't want to throw it away. Yeah, so welcome for lunch, guys. It's in the afternoon and I'm trying something new and I'm going to tag you along. So I want to roast ground nuts. I have done a video before. on. In fact, my first YouTube video was on how to roast ground nuts. But then I used a pan. So I want to try it in my oven today. With, of course, some tips I learned from one of the YouTubers. And I'm grateful her channel is called Taina Lois. I don't know if that is the correct pronunciation. Thank you very much for guiding me through. And I'm trying it. I love learning myself. And I'm hoping that I'll get the best outcome. So let's do it, guys. Remember to preheat uh, your oven. And you can do this as you wash your ground nuts. is part of our Sunday routine. So to tell a lucky dog as I wait for my ground nuts to cook. Yep, I've set them for a few minutes and uh, so by the time we are waking up they are going to be ready for us to eat as a four o'clock snack. Joy Shusha Miguna Ulale. My baby is just playing and she's the main reason why I normally take naps on Sunday. Because tomorrow Lazima Amkema Pema. Monday is usually one of my busiest days at work. And for that reason, I must rest on Sunday. I must, must, must. And I must have this nap. So where do you go on Sunday afternoons? By the way, today I was thinking of taking my daughter out. Lakini ile jua iko huku. I can't. Watch a tutulale. Let's have a nap for a few minutes. Yeah. Menjuku karangas are ready. Thank you, Christine. I learned. I think I am now confident with my oven. I can easily bake uh, my ground nuts using it. As compared to the previous process that I had showed using a pan, this one is a bit easier because you use less energy stirring. You don't even stir. You don't stir as much as you do while while cooking them using a pan. And I highly recommend, if you have an oven, you can try this out. I don't think I will go back to doing uh, the pan again. I'm happy about this. They are ready. Atakama zilikuwa karibu kungua kidogo. I think I overset the time. But they are still edible. Yeah. And very, very sweet. Actually, they are already cool. I'm just going to get the husks off. The then we will consume them with our four o'clock tea. Later in the evening, I restocked my eggs. It's about nine. You may realize I'm only left with one egg and I will be using it. I using them during breakfast. So nimeenda nikatafuta. Apparently, right now my baby is asleep. There she is, alikata kulala mchana. So, amelala mapema. So, I'm just going to unpack them. Then I'll go have a quick shower. I think you can hear my water is heating. Then there's some online work that I need to finish up before going to bed. So, guys, let's do this together. So these ones will take me for the next two weeks. Nowadays, my baby does not love eggs. I don't know why. She's, she has really hated them. So isn't it a kula peke angu? 
but so that I can make her eat, I'll just do some pancakes tomorrow. Then she will consume them in there. Nanisha vunja moja. This one, so I'll start with it. Just separate it. Hello, beautiful people, and how are you doing? It's a beautiful Monday morning from where I'm shooting from. I'm already dressed up for work and my bag is right there. And I need to complete this vlog. And uh, yeah, let's go to work. Alafu, I'll, I'll tag you along as I go for my rice. You may realize that uh, supermarket rice is becoming very expensive for me. So I think I'll go back to my normal Kishori rice. So I'm going to tag you along and uh, give you the, the good prices of where I buy from. I'm also going to insert the number of uh, the woman I normally buy from. She sells pure Pishori rice in Gedorai 45. So I'm going to tag you along as I go to buy it. Maybe it could be a plug for you because it's very cheap. She, she sells it at wholesale price. And in case you need to buy in bulk, you can consider buying from her. She also sends parcels. And her rice is very, very good. It's not that I'm advertising her. Then sometimes I used to sell uh, cereals and I used to order from her. And true to be true, true to be sure or whatever, her rice was very, very okay. So come with me, guys. I'll go to work. Then Nikki talk and it's a pity and Nikki chukwe yom chele. Ewa mokami. picked my rice my five kgs at least this one is going to take us for the whole of the next month uh, before i organize myself on getting back to my normal rice which has become very expensive so that is pure pishori rice i have uh, indicated where i bought it i bought it in githurai 45 and uh kwa your billboard uh I have already, the number is already indicated there. So I've also bought some milk. I think today everything is just frustrating me. I normally buy ATM milk, lakini penye huwa nanunua. I didn't get the owner. So ni mefanya mahesabu. I don't think I'm going to go along that route anytime soon. So I've had to just go in the supermarket and uh, buy some. We normally consume, uh, when I'm doing the packet milk, tunapikanga chai kidogo, so we will do these quarters until I get time to go look for milk. I've also purchased my daughter some yogurt. And yeah, I wish to end this video here, guys. I hope you have enjoyed my weekend vlog. So uh, normally on my weekends, I like organizing myself for the whole week. That's why I had to do the rice, the eggs, the milk, and everything because i hate purchasing things katikati ya wiki so guys let me end this video there and in case you need to this vlog uh to this uh channel please make sure you subscribe bye bye